Alright, this is intense. We're actually coming at you live here in Belize, Key Cocker, out here between San Pedro, Key Cocker back there, um, hanging out. These guys right here are spear fishing. We just did hand line fishing. Uh, none of that fancy, you know, poles and jibs and all sorts of crazy, you know, stuff that they have uh, that most people use. These guys just use a reel or a, a, a hand line. Spool of line, yeah. Spool of line, yeah. a nail, and some bait that they just caught moments ago. They throw it in, boom, they've caught two fish within about five minutes. We haven't caught anything yet because we're, pretty, we're practicing. We're we pretty new. Practice. We're practicing. We've got Lloyd and his two friends. Uh, we're just hanging out on a small boat, just eating fruit, drinking beers, hanging out, living the life here in uh, Belize. So we'll uh, update you when we get, we get going with the spear guns and we'll show you what we caught. Just pull it out. Slowly. Yep. Wow. Check that out. This is where you put it. So when you take off all this stuff, it'll be lone meat, you know? Lone white muscle. You got one. There he is, right here. The grunt fish. Go listen to it. Completely messed up. Just beat the crap out of it. He uh, helped us out. We just broke this thing to smithereens, but now I will show you how to take it out. <laughs> now that you annihilated. Now that I annihilated the cunt shell. He's like, you wrecked my home. Turning off my goggles. I'm going in. Out with Lloyd and his two buddies. Um, they just caught a bunch of fish. We actually just saw a nurse shark chased after it, got some good video. Um, also, got one of his buddies swimming down under with the spear gun, just being super chill, super calm. Boom! Shooting it. So, pretty cool. So, we're just hanging out. This is an awesome experience. What I'm gonna do next is a backflip off the boat <laughs> while they're out doing their thing. Okay? Begin with review and friend. Great. Ready? Set. Alright, here we are. We're back, uh, back from the hunt. Back from the hunt. <laughs> Lloyd is amazing. He's pretty, pretty good, huh? He's uh, <laughs> shooting all sorts of stuff. What kind of stuff did you shoot down there? Man, well, I shoot a red snapper, a black snapper, yellow jack, and the hagfish. We also got the. Also got the sea chicken. Oh, the sea chicken. Yeah. Check out this. Yeah. Then we this also got the. Uh, is the big a one. sea chicken. How cool is that? This thing is the funniest looking thing and it's hard too. You got lobster, you got all sorts of conch, hunk. What's yeah. this one? That's a old wife. Old wife? Yeah, old wife snapper. Old wife snapper. Yeah. Yeah, good stuff. Here in Belize. Is everything on?
tomato, sweet pepper, onion, Uncle. you know? Uncle, you put it inside. Oh, cabbage, yes I, all inside of the tummy, inside everything, you know? They put a little extra butter on the top, so everything left real creamy and nice, you know? Yes I. Wrap it up. Yeah, then from there, wrap it with the foil. From there, we're good to go. Dude, that was quite the adventure <laughs> down in Belize. Spear Dude. fishing, man. I'd never done anything like that. That before. was awesome. I love Amazing. spear fishing. Dude, and how many do you catch back here in uh, in the Caribbean? <laughs> I think I caught my limit. <laughs> I even had to throw Crazy. a couple back. <laughs> but when you're out traveling and you're seeking out authentic experiences, sometimes it's as easy as just asking a local and doing what the locals do. That's right, and just being up for the adventure, really. Exactly. Speaking of that, we have a question for our audience today. Yeah, what do we got? We've got the blank slate question of the day. All right. What's an authentic experience that you've had? Send us in your responses on our Facebook fan page at The Whiteboard Experience. We'd love to hear from you. Now, just in the last two episodes, we've been mm -hmm. hanging out poolside in our outdoor set, yeah. if you will. And we also have, our viewers have probably seen us back in our indoor set. Yes, back at the headquarters. That's so right. Tune in next time to see the backstory behind The Whiteboard Studios.